Hey, what's up guys and welcome to today's video and today I'm giving you an update on the home gym and giving you a complete ab workout. I thought we'd combine two videos together. Now, you all remember the previous home gym, now it's all been stripped out and uh, there's just some boxes and loads of plastic bits on the floor from the old flooring and equipment um, and we finally moved to the garage. Now, please bear in mind that this is still only phase one. We've got lots of storage equipment coming, so just to make things neater, we've got a new squat rack and benches, leg extension. So this is like the beta phase, I like to call it, but we've got the garage door on and it looks pretty good so far. So let's go check it out. The new garage door. You ready guys, you ready? And here we are. All right guys, so here it is. There's a lot of stuff that I need to show you. I'm very, very proud of it. Me and Domi are very proud of it. It's like our little child. Um, and we keep just buying things for it. It's like buying clothes for a little baby. Um, I guess, I don't know. But let me take you to the dumbbell rack. So we are still missing a few dumbbells, but we've got uh, dumbbells from, we will have dumbbells from five to 50 kilos on the new rack, uh, going in increments of five kilos because you don't need that 2.5 jump, you've got to jump even higher and this is pretty much everything you'll need. Um, so I've got some primal strength ones here that are awesome and just some random hex ones and some origin ones. Um, I like started with just, a, just the 15s and then they just grew. Um, I'm really happy with these amazing dumbbells. Uh, then we've got the bench which I've had for a long time. Uh, it's just a bench from uh, Strength Shop. Uh, and yeah, moving on, we've uh, got the mirrors um, hello, we're enjoying them. Uh, so I just decided to do floor to, uh, well, floor to the top because it gives you a good view and um, we're just having a great time with it. <laughs> then we have probably the most important part of the gym here is the, um, the carbon heater because on those winter nights it will get a little bit cold in here but it's pretty well insulated kind of. Um, so you will work up a bit of a sweat. Um, and then newest addition for something that I don't actually have yet, I've got the attachments. So these are like mag grip attachments. I've got them from wide to close. I uh, haven't got the cables yet because they're coming soon. Um, but these grips, if you ever use them when you're rowing or doing pull any la uh, horizontal pull downs or vertical pull downs, these are amazing. Definitely try them if you can get your hands on them or you have a gym that uses them. Uh, I've got the old squat rack, nothing special. It's a bit rickety. Um, I remember I bought this for 90 pounds at the beginning of lockdown and now these are like retailing at 200, 299. I'm just like, everyone's trying to make the most of lockdown. But uh, where we've got a few more days, then England starts opening up, so it's good. So. This is our current storage solution. Just a bunch of IKEA bags and reusable bags. Got some insulation there. I'm not sure if we're going to use it, um, but we've got a calyx coming from IKEA. We're going to have some nice organisation. That's all Domi's design. It's going to be amazing because uh, I have no idea about like storage or anything like that. I just know how to put bars up. And uh, this is my little bar collection. We've got the trap bar, which actually came today. I love trap bars. It's not only good for doing shrugs. Uh, and legs, you can actually do shoulders, rows, so much with it. I'll be doing, showing you some great exercises with that. Got the curl bar, got the multi-grip bar, um, and obviously the two barbells. Pretty much everything you'll need. Uh, and then, Domi's, one of Domi's birthday presents <laughs> is the Brett Contreras hip thrust uh, bench. So, if you know Domi, she hip thrusts three times a week, yeah. And she has an over 200 kilo hip thrust for 10 <laughs> reps. So, you know, proofs in the pudding. Um, and obviously we've got her plates here. Gives you the perfect setup for that hip thrust. Um, she loves it. You love it? <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> and the last piece of equipment so far is the titanium strength air bike. Now, this is going to be the only cardio equipment we have in here, but it's pretty much everything you need. If you know me and you follow me on Instagram, this is my favorite piece of cardio equipment because 
it's like a total body workout. It gets your heart pumping. Go maxed out, 15 seconds on here, you're done. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, but I've been doing a 10 seconds on, 20 seconds active recovery. Repeat that 10 times, three times a week. And I've been feeling amazing after doing it. Um, and they were kind enough to send this out to me. Uh, they're having some... <laughs> that it, it just wants to did you just a, burp uh, no yes you did <laughs> no, I didn't. you did it was the bike okay <laughs> um but they were kind enough to send this out to me if you do want to check titanium strength out follow the link in the description they have an amazing deals on at the moment and if you want extra off they've got a code marino5 uh to take some more off these amazing pieces of kit um and yeah the rest of the gym is just flooring um, which I just found, eh, it really wants to be known, doesn't it? Uh, flooring from Amazon. Um, I didn't go with the like thick gym flooring just because I didn't feel like we needed it. Um, and this will do, and I've just got some, when I do deadlifts, I've got some pads here. And uh, that pretty much wraps up. Oh, obviously we've got the dip. The dips, uh, dip machine right here with uh, the ladder. Or <laughs> ladder of uh wisdom wisdom uh but yeah and the bands obviously but uh that pretty much wraps up the gym uh we've got some more equipment coming so this is only phase one uh, obviously all the storage uh new uh, squat rack cable smith machine combo and leg extension because it's my favorite exercise and i don't want to incorporate too many glutes in my legs that's what all compounds do it's just glutes 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 um, but yes, this is the home gym so far. We're loving it and I can't wait to show you the next phase, but is it still making noise? Yeah. <laughs> but let's stop talking about the gym and let's get to working out. I'm going to show you a complete core workout now. Let's go. All right guys. So going into the ab workout today, it's going to be no equipment. So we're just doing six exercises back to back for five rounds. Now, this is great for anyone who doesn't have any equipment at home. Um, I think right now is probably one of the best ways to train because a lot of people don't have access to the gym. So I'm going to be showing the exercise. I'm going to do it for 30 seconds straight into the next one with no rest. Once all six exercises are complete, then you get to rest. So let's go. All right, guys. Let's go. I'm starting with reverse crunches. Straight into the next exercise, bicycle crunches. next one these are really really hard so to make it easier have your hands further back if you want to make it harder push it forward so 30 seconds let's go The next one, mountain climbers. Let's do it. So we're twisting one, two, four, five, six, seven. Oh. 
Oh, nice. This is a really tough one. So we're doing toe, toe touches in the crab position. You ready? Let's go. So get up. One, one. Nice. Now, into the last exercise. So we're doing plank twists. 30 seconds, let's go. So in the plank position, twisting your hips, one. Nice one guys, Woo. trust me, we do that for five rounds, six rounds, your abs are going to be on fire. Now, I've got four more rounds to do. Alright guys, I'm done, uh, that workout was awesome. So what I recommend when you are doing uh, like bodyweight ab exercises like this, you can do it on its own if you really like, but what I tend to do is after my main workout, say it be legs or upper body, I do a little core circuit like this. I very rarely do any weighted abs because personally, I don't feel like you need to, especially through a lot of other lifts, you'll develop them anyway. Just doing that conditioning, working on your compound lifts, being in a calorie deficit, you'll reveal your abs. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the tour of the new home gym. I'm gonna update you as soon uh, as everything comes, all the equipment's done, and it's all neat because it is just looking rough at the moment. Um, but I can't wait to show you that, and if you do try the ab workout, please let me know. And if anything, I'll see you in the next one. We're almost free, we can almost travel. We can also go to the Christmas market soon, can't we? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stay safe, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.